Hello, my name is Minter Dial, and I'd like to give you a short video called Come Together, the special effects of four words. About our context and what we're looking for. Great teamwork, cross-departmental collaboration, fluid access to information, real-time answers, total engagement, staff motivation. Isn't that what we're just looking for? These are just some of the major challenges facing companies today as they adapt to the fast-paced, web-enhanced world. In this short video, I'd like to introduce you to a profound concept that can help bring about change in your organization. In today's context, managers and employees are dealing with ever higher degrees of stress, producing and performance issues, ever more limited resources in time and money. They may be blaming, Objectives and roles too often lacking in clarity. It's just not what people are looking for. It just seems like the cost of doing business. But it doesn't have to be that way. People want to learn. They want to feel good, prefer to participate wholeheartedly. And of course, they'd like to be recognized. Introducing the want. I-W-A-N-T-U. First, curiosity may have killed the cat but it's a fundamental motive for all of us. When you want something done expediently, remember to explain why you want it. If you put the why back into the busyness of business, your staff will act with greater attention. Explaining why is all about transmission and learning. What is one of the foulest three-letter words that you know? For me, it's the but word, B-U-T. But is a stopper, a buzzkill, not just in brainstorming sessions. Take out the but and start inserting the word and. Try it. You will see how liberating it can be and how it encourages broader participation. Thirdly, you explain why and you're adding the and into your sentence. That's great. But in a world of ever limited resources, one of the most overlooked areas of management is the discernment to select what not to do, to say no to just another idea. Fourth, the T. You have explained why you have a more positive attitude. You have bared down on the key strategic choices to make your investments more effective and powerful. Now your team deserves the recognition. Just remember to say thank you. It doesn't take long to swing by to thank a teammate personally and it certainly feels good to be appreciated. Why not do it in their language too, if you want to personalize your effort? So there you have it. Start with explaining why, insert and in the place of but, actively choose what not to do, and don't forget to say thank you. That's what I call the I want you.